She once said her greatest fear in life was to be forgotten. 100 years after her birth, 100 evitas marched through the centre of Buenos Aires to ensure that Eva Perón is remembered. Her whole life as a young, beautiful woman, an actress, she was an example of what a woman can be. The name and the image of the former First Lady still shine in all corners of Argentina. Books are still written about her. Schools, hospitals and restaurants are named after her. This dessert concocted in her honour. We're incorporating the image, the figure of Evita, the values she represented, the sensibility. Her main value was her sensibility, which is necessary to overcome the difficult times we're facing now. Eva Duarte was born on the 7th of May 1919 in the Argentine countryside. A wealthy father abandoned the family to poverty. Age 15, she sought and found fame and fortune as an actress in Buenos Aires. There she met the rising politician, the then Labour minister, Juan Domingo Perón, at a function to raise money for earthquake victims. The rest, as they say, is history. Being a woman fighting for social justice, for equality, she was taken into the hearts of the Argentine people and is part of the universal story, and today everyone here in Argentina remembers her. The couple married in 1945, and the following year he became president of Argentina. A plain, skinny girl with prominent teeth transformed herself into a glamour icon, both revered and despised. She was something of an enigma while she was alive. A champion of the poor wearing furs, a fighter for women's rights in a man's world, a showbiz superstar ahead of her time. 67 years after her death, that attraction, that influence, remains just as strong. Former president and probable candidate in this year's elections, Cristina Fernandez de Kirchner, describes her as an inspiration. In a way, I think that Evita inspires the new struggles. And today, you can see that many of those movements, many of the demonstrations in the street, you have young people with uh, a T-shirt with Evita, uh, a sign with Evita, and they still think about Evita. Still emulated, sometimes denigrated. However, Evita Perón, 100 years after her birth, has very clearly not been forgotten. Daniel Schweimer, Al Jazeera, Buenos Aires.